All right, let's check out this two-door hardtop. 1962 Buick LeSabre, two-door hardtop. Now, one thing I will point out, it does need a little bit of TLC as far as with the trim pieces, and the trim pieces will not be coming along with the car. Do not have them. Uh, there are a few extra things that come with it, and I'll kind of point those out as I get around to the rear. But would need a little, little TLC in the trim pieces, and I believe that's both sides. I'd consider this more of a driver quality paint. Also, um, you know, in the video here, it it's got a decent kind of shine to it up in the front quarter, but you do get in certain part, parts of the car. If I get to top of it, there you can see where the shine is a little dulled so it's not completely even as far as the finish all the way around the car so say more a little driver quality as far as underneath the hood uh engine appears to be out of a 65 buick it's an lt code blocks so would be a 401 v8 and uh, that appears that it's been gone through runs great we'll start this thing up uh, before the video ends here and we'll start it up and that is paired with an automatic transmission has power steering power brakes on it and again, the, the engine bay is nice and tidy on this one. Uh, if you want to check out the still picture, so you can see what I'm talking about, check out the underside interior, that engine bay trunk, uniqueclassiccars.com. That's where you can check out the still pictures. Down below this video in the description, there's a link. Click on it. That's going to take you right to our website where the pictures are. And of course, you can call us too, 507-386-1726. Buick wheel covers, white wall radials. You can see the bright work on it, a little bit of peeling on the front bumper there. And uh, you're going to find places where, you know, it could use just a little touch-up. Again, more of a driver quality. Um, down below, I did notice just a little bit of bubbling in the rear front fender, or excuse me, passenger side front fender. And then again, where you could use that trim piece up and down the passenger side. Now, this was originally... Uh, Marlin blue car uh, with blue interior still still blue and blue a little aftermarket Retro digital radio that was added to it. That does work Now remember we do consider trades financing is available Of course we can assist you with getting this car to where you're located at and it may be eligible for an extended service contract uh, Here are some of the things that went with it Looks like there was an extra dash there and uh, car cover, a couple of extra belts. Rear bumper, chrome, doesn't seem to be really peeling or rusted. Bright work, I would say, is average condition. Last time we seem a little more pitted, so the bright work on this car isn't actually bad in the rear tail lights there. And once again, check out those still pictures, uniqueclassiccars.com. Down below this video in the description, there's a link. Click on it. That's going to take you right there. Of course, that number 507-386-1726. And again, certain portions of the car, like here you can see, a little more of a luster to it. It's just some of the top side has faded a little bit of the paint shows its age. Definitely had to repaint along the line somewhere. All right, let's check out the interior. Rear seats, I didn't notice any rips or tears much for wearing them. Uh, front seat, there was a couple, two, three spots over on that passenger side there. I'm going to go ahead and start this up. The car starts very easily. Fires right up. Um, did have the wipers. Tried those earlier. Wipers do work fine. There's that retro radio that I was talking about. Padded dash. interior blower fan worked also switch for that would be right here that does work all right let's uh, slip around to the back of this door closes nicely nice sound in the getting that 401 seems to be a smooth run let's go ahead and pop this engine so you can check out the engine bay let's take a look at the V8 under the hood. Alright, here we go. 401, like I said, it's an LT blocks. It's going to be out of a 65 Buick. 
power steering, power brakes. But again, you cover the paint. Engine's gone through somewhere along. Whoops, sorry about that. <laughs> Been gone through somewhere along the line here. Here, smooth runner. Pretty tidy under the engine bay, under the hood. And that is paired up with an automatic transmission. So there you go, you're looking for a two door Buick. Get into the collector car hobby without breaking the bank, or maybe one you want to spend a little bit of time with the body and just kind of bring her up to the next level. Here it is, 1962 Buick with Sabre, two-door hardtop. Give us a call, 507-386-1726, uniqueclassiccars.com. Go to the website to check out all the still pictures down below this video in the description. Click on the link there, it's going to take you right there. And remember, we do consider trades. Financing is available. Of course, we can assist you with getting this car to where you're located at, and it may be eligible for an extended service contract. Consult with your sales associate when you call it or email.